Hi friends, it's Mrs. McCoy here for this week's library lesson. We are back in my backyard and we have a nice sunny day after we've had some big rain the last few days. So I thought it was perfect to come out here and record our story in the sunshine today. So let's sing our song, ready? Put your hands out for me. One, two, three. Open, shut them, open, shut them. Give a little clap, clap, clap. Open, shut them, open, shut them. Fold them in your lap, lap, lap. Creep them, creep them, creep them, creep them. Right up to your chinny, chin, chin. Open up your little mouth. Ah, but do not let them in. Good job, everyone. We have a fun story today. It is called Fast Food. Fast Food. And this story is written by Saxton Freeman. And the pictures are by Juiced Elfers. And the cool thing about the pictures in this book, they're all photographs. And they're all photographs of food fruits and vegetables and different kinds of food that you might recognize. Let's see, anyone know what kind of vegetable this is on the cover? Hmm, it's green. It's kind of oval shaped. Yeah, you're right. It's a cucumber. A cucumber. That's my daughter's favorite vegetable. And what about this little guy driving this cucumber car? Let's see, he's red. He's round. Anyone know what he is? He's a radish. And he's a pretty rad radish. He's driving a race car. Let's see what other kinds of food cars we have inside the book. Fast food. Ooh, these are our end papers that aren't right inside the cover. There's lots of different food vehicles there. How cool is that? Do you think the artist took a long time making those? I think so. I think they did lots of hard work to make all those food vehicles. Here's our title page, that page that says the title and the author again, our title page. Your feet can walk and run and skip, but are they best for every trip? With skates, a walk becomes a glide. A skateboard can extend your stride. Need something you can hold on to? A scooter might be right for you. Raise your hand, have you ever roller skated before? Yeah. What about riding on a skateboard? That's pretty fun. What about a scooter? I like riding on a scooter. I don't really ride on a skateboard, but I like scooters and roller skates. I do both of those things. I hope you guys are doing all kinds of things like this to stay active and healthy while you're home. If you cannot walk about, a wheelchair's here to help you out. Oh, look, that little mushroom man has an orange wheelchair to ride on. Pedal hard aboard a bike. Add a wheel and it's a trike. There's a bike and a trike. The tricycle has three wheels. One, two, three. And the bicycle just has two. One, two. That's because by like bicycle means two and try like tricycle means three. Down snowy hills, you'll need some skis. Bundle up so you don't sneeze. Should we sneeze together? Ready? One, two, three, big sneeze. One, two, three. Ah-choo! Good job. I could hear your sneeze from all the way over here. Ice skates are for crossing ice. But on the snow, a sleigh is nice. What a cool sleigh. And this beard is made of cauliflower. And the reindeer is made of ginger. How cute. Sometimes you'll want to travel far. Maybe then you'll choose a car. It might be wise if more of us would ride together. In a bus. 
If you have heavy loads to haul, a truck will help you move them all. A fire truck speeds toward a fire full of heroes who inspire. But fire trucks can't hesitate. When sirens wail, please stop and wait. What a cool fire truck. I think it's made of bell peppers. Have you ever tried a bell pepper before? They're pretty tasty. And it's got one, two firefighters inside. Trains speed along, click clack, click clack, to all the stations on the track. They're in the ocean. On water, it is best to float, so climb aboard your favorite boat. Some move by motors, some by rowing. Some only when the wind is blowing. What kind of boat only moves when the wind is blowing? Starts with an S. S sailboat, that's right. This sailboat has a big piece of kale for the sail. Sailboat. If there's no rush, there's nothing finer than cruising on an ocean liner. Want to see the ocean floor? A submarine lets you explore. Submarines go under the water, deep, deep in the ocean. To travel far and fast, you fly in an airplane through the sky. What? A banana plane. Have you ever flown on an airplane before? Was it made out of a banana? I hope not. A helicopter chops the air. It hovers and lands anywhere. Go by blimp or by balloon. Or take a rocket past the moon. By foot, on wheels, by air or sea, I hope that soon you'll visit me. Ah, there's a little mushroom man in his house, and there's a whole bus coming to see him, and a car, a bicycle, a sailboat, a plane, someone walking, so many vegetable friends coming to visit. And that is the end of fast food. Did you like that story? I thought those photos were so cool how they used all those fruits and vegetables to make those vehicles. I'm going to put in the link of this video, I'm going to put some directions for you to make your own apple and grape cars at home. You can take some apples and grapes or other fruit or veggies that you might have at your house. And to make a snack, you can make it into a little car that can almost drive around on its little fruit wheels. So maybe you can ask a grown up at home or a big brother or sister to help you make that for a snack today or sometime this week. So check for the link below. I'll, sit, I'll put directions there too. All right, friends, that is the end of our library time today. So let's sing our goodbye song. Ready? One, two, three. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. It's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. It's time to say goodbye. Nice job at library today, my friends. Stay healthy, have fun, keep reading, and keep growing your brains at home. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.